Celebrating South Anchorage High School, I'm John McCain. And I'm Sarah Palin. And today is Famous Couples Day, and we love the costumes we've seen so far. Today is also September 18th, and speaking of politics, we have Maya here to give you a special opportunity. Thanks, Caitlin. Hi, I'm Maya. I'm currently interning for a local campaign and having a great time. It's a great opportunity to learn about government and the democratic process at a local level while working on a campaign that you enjoy. I have met multiple state candidates, as well as attended multiple fundraisers, campaign events, and have even listened to two U.S. senators speak. I think it's a really enriching experience to get involved in politics at such a young age because you're able to better understand the democratic process and become a more informed citizen. Volunteering for a campaign is a great way to get involved in your community, as well as receive community service hours. See me at the next Key Club meeting to get more information on all candidates and initiative plans. You must have a school ID to go to the homecoming dance. If you need one, come to the library before school, after school, or during lunch to have one made. Please do not wait until the last day. The PTSO will be hosting an all-school breakfast tomorrow, September 19th, for the entire student body and staff. It will start at 6.45 a.m. and go until 7.30. It will be held in the Commons. This is a free breakfast for everyone. Pancakes, bacon, bagels, muffins, and much more will be served. Hey, hey Caitlin, where, yeah, where, where, where does a pancake live? I don't know, Quinn. In a flat. Uh. <laughs> the Alaska Native Heritage Center's after-school high school program will start today and tomorrow from 3 to 5 p.m. Those who attend 120 hours in our program can receive half an elective credit through Anchorage School District's Credit by Choice program. Let's check out the open tennis match from Tuesday. There will be a lunch meeting tomorrow in the upper gym for all girls interested in playing basketball this year. South Varsity defeated, defeated Service three sets to zero last night. Set one, South 25, Service 15. Set two, South 25, Service 18. And set three, South 25, Service 9. McKenna Hurd had seven kills. Kayla Sim had 25 assists and three aces. Shelby Little had five kills and five blocks. And Aspen Avery had 19 picks. Thank you to all the spirited fans who turned out. The whiteout was really awesome. I'd love to play basketball. In other news, audiobooks are available in the library. Get your homecoming book, get your homecoming tickets by the elevator at lunch and join us for some fun games. You must bring your signed dance contract to get tickets and not have any fines. There's always a huge line on Friday, so make sure to save yourself the hassle and get them early this week. As you know, today's famous famous couples day and tomorrow is black and gold day. Partners Club is meeting every Tuesday at lunch in room E-104. We will start next week, Tuesday, September 2nd. That's last week. Please come and check out what the club is about. Treats will be provided. Calling all South athletes. The 2014-2015 bowling season is starting on Monday, September 29th at the Jewel Lake Bowl, starting at 3.30. There will be a team participant and parent meeting on Wednesday, the 24th of September at South. The location is yet to be announced. Bowling is a lot of fun. No experience is required to join the team. Check out our website at www.sahsbowling.com slash wolverines. Remember that physicals and paperwork must be completed for you to participate. Remember, next week there is an informational meeting Thursday at 2.05 p.m. You know where it is. The Bible Club will meet in Miss D. Pilatus' room, G1112, today at lunch. October 20th to the 22nd marks the 30th anniversary of the Elders and Youth Conference. The 2014 conference theme is Get Up, Stand Up, and is focused on catalyzing and growing the voice and spirit of our youth and our elders as critical leaders in our communities. As Anchorage residents, our Alaska Native and American Indian students have a unique opportunity to participate in this conference through the Title now, er, Title VII, right, Caitlin? Title VII Indian Education Program. Our program allows for us to assist 20 students from each middle and high school to participate in the conference by paying their registration fee. Their registration fee. Pre-teaching knowledge and skills will promote full participation by students, providing supervision during the event and reflecting with staff and students after the event. All interested students will be asked to complete an application that includes an essay question in order to fully gauge the student's interest and commitment about to the cause. Students are required to have a 2.5 GPA and fewer than five absences in order to attend. They are also required to bring their own lunch and provide their own transportation. Old Navy at the Diamond Center is hiring and wants South High students to apply. If you need some cash, this will be the job for you. Stop by and pick up an application. 
Remember, Sal, the Swing Choir is selling South Colored Tide Blankets this week. They're great for staying warm and showing some school spirit at games. You can buy your Tide Blanket all week during lunch or at the homecoming game for $20. Seniors, the final deadline for senior ad photos and senior portraits is October 16th. This is the final deadline. Please turn in the photos as soon as possible. Late fees will be applied for those who turn them in late. If you have not bought a senior ad, you can buy it on Zangle, print the receipt, and bring the receipt to G212 during 6 hour or after school. Do it soon because there are limited spaces and this is on a first come, first serve basis. That's all for today, Wolverines. Have a great day.